when 17-year-old high school senior Jamal Hinton got a text telling him Thanksgiving dinner was at 3 this year. Wow, it's either the wrong number or my grandma learned how to use her phone. So Jamal asked for a picture and got a selfie of Wanda Dench, somebody's grandma, just not his. He texted me back with his picture and said, you ain't my grandma, <laughs> but can I still have a plate? That's where you might expect the story to end. But like a true grandma. I said, sure you can. I said, um, you know, that's what grandmas do. The two met last night, and Jamal's whole family is now going to Wanda's for Thanksgiving. You know, I've got to figure out how, how big a turkey I need for 20 people. Their text touched a nerve. I'm at 392,000 likes, 186,000 retweets, and 1.7 million views. We've noticed that people are seeking these feel good, um, you know, uplifting, heartwarming, humanizing stories. How much do people rally around stories like this? Oh, you see, like, Tons and tons. Yes. So Earlier this year, a couple system. mistakenly sent a group text to strangers about their new baby boy. The recipients they had never met brought gifts to the hospital. And who could forget Sad Papa, who hosted a barbecue for hundreds after his grandkids didn't show up for homemade burgers. For new friends Jamal and Wanda this year, there is a lot to be thankful for. I feel like everybody sees this joy that two people, two strangers can actually connect leaving the rest of us thankful for the smile. Kristen Dahlgren, NBC News, New York. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.